Madam President, Amendment 3920 would prevent indexed annuities investors from benefiting from strong protections from federal securities laws. That's the reason I'm objecting. Some consumers have been hurt, including some in Hawaii. Deceptive sales practices have been found to be used in these products. An individual in Hawaii pushed equity index annuities to collect high commissions at the expense of senior investors. Those investors least able to effectively evaluate financial products need uh, these federal protections without question and they've been suffering. I'm not alone in my opposition to the amendment. As my friend from Iowa mentioned uh, that AARP is opposed. The Consumer Federation of American and the North American Securities Administration Association also oppose it. And this matter is under litigation and under review within the SEC rulemaking process. Madam President, equity index annuities are financial products that combine aspects of insurance and securities, but which are sold primarily as investments. These products must have the strong disclosure, suitability, and sales practice standards provided within the context of our nation's securities laws. The amendment would preclude state and federal securities regulators from protecting investors from inappropriate and harmful products. I am willing to work with my friend from Iowa to look into this matter for further. We need to have hearings to know more about the situation before taking such a potentially precedent-setting action as this amendment would do. If this were to prevent securities regulation of a product that clearly has characteristics of a, of a security. We will encourage the development of financial products created to avoid the, strong, the stronger protection standards. Thank you very much, uh, Madam President.